vaccination involves the introduction of a weakened form of a disease to the body to enable the immune system to develop agents that will fight off a full-fledged attack from the disease pathogen. During the 19th century, the first mass vaccination programs were introduced. They targeted smallpox, a disease that still claimed a huge death toll. In the 20th century, different vaccines were developed targeting diseases like polio. Soon it was realized that diseases like smallpox could be eradicated if worldwide immunization programs were carried out. Today, the United Nations supports a number of vaccination programs. Here in Afghanistan, doctors are administering the Sabin oral vaccine to protect children from polio. During a three-day immunization period across Afghanistan and Pakistan, the organizers aim to administer 2.8 million doses to children under five years of age. By 1979, medical authorities felt that smallpox had been extinguished and their next target was polio, which continues to persist in parts of Africa and Asia. Because the Sabin vaccine is administered as droplets directly into the mouth, it is ideally suited to this type of mass inoculation, where the use of syringes for injection of the vaccine presents problems of hygiene and social acceptability. By 2006, polio had been limited to just four countries, Nigeria, India, Pakistan and Afghanistan. And in that year, only 2,000 cases were reported. Since 1988, thanks to volunteer work by 20 million health workers across the world, 2 billion children have received vaccination against the polio virus.